Hello, Keiko here, and welcome to the chaos. Let's go. So, um, this stream might be a bit more chaotic than usual for four reasons. <laughs> Do <laughs> the reasons want to explain themselves? I have no idea why it would be chaotic. Yeah, no reason at all. Don't know if you can hear them very well. Do let me know. But um, I have been joined by two people. Um, let me see. <sighs> two entities. There are two entities Thank behind you. me. Um, and so we've got Child of Peace is here, and also Indoor Petrichor's here. So yeah, they're going to be high prisoner. Oh, um, I didn't kidnap them. I promise. If anything, they broke into my house. <laughs> anyway, let's see. Let's see. Uh. Okay, who can't pronounce anything one two yeah that's pretty much it that's pretty much i can't pronounce anything <laughs> so yeah apparently i'm being haunted today we've got um child of peace is here and it'll here and child of peace being here is why i'm in the teapot because apparently my teapot wasn't that bad and i didn't have to fix that many things because Indul Petrical liked the bit that was quite cursed and therefore he balanced it out <laughs> so but uh child of peace did redecorate a second house and so I figured we'd start the stream by letting them explain this, and then we'd go to Fontaine for the scavenger hunts, and I thought it might be quite fun if I let Child of Peace have a go. See how they like falling off of the cliffs um, all the time and struggling to climb up walls. So yeah, so it's going to be a bit of a funky, funky stream, and you might see the Keiko model might get, get upset because there's more than one person in this room and it sometimes doesn't like to track the right person. And also, we're going to switch. I'm gonna let Child of Peace sit in this chair and try and figure out how to do the things. So I might be muffled <laughs> because I'm gonna sit on the floor. Um, and yeah, so if the Keiko model goes crazy, that's probably because we're switching who's sitting in the chair. Um, so yeah, I hope you enjoy this chaos. I don't know what they have, I think they have plans they haven't told me about for chaos reasons. I guess we're gonna find out together because I don't know what's going on. <laughs> it's, it's gonna be crazy. Um, let me see, let me see. Am I being haunted again? Yes. Yeah, we've got some ghosts. Ooh, Adirax's teapot's nice. Well, that's good to know. That's good to know. Keiko of peace? Pretty much, pretty much. The Keiko models, that is true. It's very upset with the ghosts. And that's why it's glitching. The, it doesn't like ghosts. <laughs> child 127. Yes, oh, we also thought it'd be very funny if we had child fight child. So <laughs> when we get to the boss fight section, we might give that a go. Just to like, I just think it would be quite funny, especially bearing in mind <laughs> Child of Peace's grand summer playing Genshin has been decorating the teapots and like navigating while decorating the teapot. Like earlier, I saw them climb a pillar by mistake. <laughs> We're doing it on purpose, thank you very much. It was by mistake. I saw them run into a wall and just start <laughs> climbing it and get stuck up there. It was very funny. It threw me back to the, the beginning of the game. And yeah, I've just watched them like try and jump on things to jump off of other things and get stuck. And so yeah, it should be quite entertaining to, <laughs> to watch that happen. So anyway, yeah, I guess I'm going to... This is a bed. <laughs> there were many, many different things. <laughs> oh, well, yeah, that's part of the chaos. You know what? Let me just face this way. Anyway, <laughs> let me, I'm going to pass it to Child of Peace to let them explain their interior design choices. And we can check out my other T-Bot. I don't remember when the last time we saw it was, but you know, might as well. I guess I can give that tour. Well, Child of Peace can give the tour of the house, because I think they did most of it, to be honest. But I did the outside, so I'll show you what I changed. And then, uh, <laughs> yeah. So, I'm gonna do that quickly. I'll be back in like, well, I won't be back, but someone will be back in like two seconds. Hello, can people hear me? Oh, also, do let us know if the audio is funky. I'm sitting as close as I can to the mic, oh, hopefully sorry. not being in frame. Did I run over your foot? No, you didn't. Cool. Wait, are you are you in charge or is it still tracking me? Uh, I <laughs> think it's it's, it's, it's tracking you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's tracking me now. It's tracking me now. <laughs> all right, all right, let's go. Um, 
What am I doing? Giving a tour? Yeah, give a tour of your room. Okay, cool. So welcome to... This is actually the guest bedroom. Um, and it's a brilliant way to wake up in the morning because you wake up to uh, this lovely view of a beautiful aquarium. Um, <laughs> and we've got three fish in there. We each chose a fish to put in there. Um, and we've got our lovely little... What's this called? Wardrobe. Wardrobe. We've got a lovely little wardrobe. We've got a little bookshelf. Because this is more of like a spare room. This is where you put your guests. You know, when you really love them and you really want them to know that like they come second to the fish. Um right, and then I have done nothing in this hallway. This hallway is completely bare. But you know what? That's fine. And this bedroom also has a lot of empty space. But this is the main bedroom. Um has of course got a little cat bed at the end because your cats are important and we've got our lovely little oh, i forgot what these are called like the dresser screens so that you can get dressed behind here in the privacy of your room so if anyone walks in they can't see you uh and then we're gonna go down the fast way we landed on the sofa uh so this is our entryway, we got, of course, the round table, because that diverts energy correctly in a space. And we have our sort of formal living room area, you know, you can sit down, relax with the dogs. And then we have this fireplace, of course. And in front of the fireplace, we have the rug, because apparently there are no dog beds. And I'm blaming Keiko for this one, even though there just aren't any in the game. Um, but I think it's Keiko's fault, and I'm gonna blame her for it. Um, <laughs> uh, and then we have a cat tree in this corner, because the cats, even though there aren't any cats down here, they deserve a place to feel, you know, loved and comfortable. Uh, and then this corner we have a little bookshelf, because I haven't actually decided what needs to go in this space yet, so... And now it's just a bookshelf. Um, I'm gonna apologize now for the zooming and like the angles that you're gonna see because I am so bad at controlling this and it's gonna be darting all over the place. <laughs> so sorry. Apologies if you be reading the chat. I have not been reading the chat. We have to do a bunch of hydro. Oh god! <laughs> Where's my water bottle? Can you pass me a water bottle, please? Pass me my Thank you. Um, we'll trade I water. Were, how many Here you go, there's bottles? yours. There are five. Five? Have okay. Fun. My water bottle is going to make noise, I'm so sorry. This is why you take more sips. Mm hmm. Four and five. Okay, I'm sorry about the water bottle noises. Um. Oh, I sound like Keiko. Keiko, I sound like you. <laughs> According to Lissy. Um, these don't do 70 hydrates. I'm not built for hydrates. <laughs> um, um, uh, yeah, it is. It's, it's, uh, we to say that. Okay, right. So, anyway, we have our wonderful dining table that is. So yeah, so we have like this lovely little backdrop for it, you know, just so you can feel like you're eating out in the lovely mountain. I think that's a mountain. Is that a mountain? Yeah, I'd say that's a mountain. Um, and then we have a gong and you have to have a gong because you've got to call people down for dinner. You've got to summon them by banging the gong instead of calling their name up the stairs. Uh, and it's right by the kitchen. So obviously you can, you know, cook your food and then have your dining space right outside. So we've got, you know, just the regular stuff. There are three places where it looks like you can cook. You can't actually cook on this one, but you can cook at this one and you can cook at this one. Um, because I couldn't choose which, 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 which aesthetic I preferred. Sorry, I, I'm going to apologise now. I do have a stutter that sometimes comes up. Um, yeah, so we've got some back counters here, which Yao Yao is shorter than. I think it, Yao Yao's shorter than the counter. 
Um, so, you know, she's not cooking anything on those counters, but she can probably cook, she can probably use the table as a counter. She needs a step stool. She does! We need to find a step stool and we need to put it in right here so that she can step up on it and cook on those counters. Um, yeah, so that's- ah! What happened? What did I do? What did I do? Hello? <laughs> ah! I clicked a button- oh, I was clicking E! I was clicking E! <laughs> I thought that was D. It was not. It was E. I'm so sorry. Right. Um, yeah, so that's our kitchen space. Um, the dogs waiting at the door. They haven't been fed yet. So sorry. Um, and then we've got this room at the front. Oh my god, these headphones are falling off. Um, Alright, so. This is our... Japanese style room. We've got the tatami mats and we've got lots of fun posters around the- well, not posters. I don't know what those are called. Um, we've got some fun stuff around the room and it's just sort of a place to sit down and eat or have conversations, whatever you want to do in there. And then our final room, the only other thing I've decorated, is this space which is our lovely office space. You know, because all offices have to have a harp, otherwise it's not an office. Uh, and yeah, I think that's everything. Are you going to take back over? To the other teapot? You want me to go to the other teapot? Uh, I can oh. remember how to do that, I think. No, I didn't. I don't know what I'm doing. Um, <laughs> Leave the house. Oh, is this go to the tubby? Yeah. Okay. Is it Tommy? Is that the name? Yes. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, it's just indoor petrichor started laughing and I was like... Come on, you said it. <laughs> okay. Tommy. Uh, okay, fair enough. By the way, I might start referring to you as Indie, short for indoor petrichor. I hope you don't mind. I got a finger guns back, so I'm going to take that as a yes. Okay. <laughs> I'm not reading the chat, I'm so bad at this. Um, <laughs> okay, let me read through the chat quickly. Um, oh, I love quoting me. That's, yeah. <laughs> I do have a book of quotes and I have some brilliant quotes from Keiko, but I don't think she'd appreciate if I shared them. Um, <laughs> these are just regular things from life that she's said. Uh, oh, my voice is lower than yours, apparently. It's ADRX says that my voice is yours but lower. Um, I'm the streamer now, yeah. I, I'm a professional streamer, I know what I'm doing. I've done this hundreds upon thousands of times. Uh, if I redeem silly voice, you will do it. Well, if you redeem silly voice, but you redeem silly voice roulette, then I come up with the accent anyway and I make Keiko do it because it's so much funnier when Keiko tries to copy me and, <laughs> and it's a disaster. Um, so I, I actually do have a silly voice to redeem and I do plan to do it this stream because I do want to make Keiko say something in a funny voice um, where you can all hear the difference between the original and Keiko's version. <laughs> um, it is a three for one deal right now, yes. Um, I blame Keiko for this. Yeah, that is exactly, <laughs> that is exactly what it is always. Um, yeah, no dinner bell, only dinner gong. It's the way it is. Does child have glasses? I do, yeah, how did you know? Oh wait, is this about the redeeming no glasses because I should warn you one of my eyes is short-sighted the other is long-sighted so it won't actually affect me um not in the way it would affect Keiko anyway Mr. Blobby is behind you Keiko and child yeah you know but I love Mr. Blobby so that's not a bad thing to me but I will just laugh as he chases Keiko everywhere it's funny. Oh, I see you've re already responded to the glasses question. <laughs> um, hang on. 
if you think you don't have glasses, think again. Yes. Uh... Oh, thank you, Lissy. It's just my voice. <laughs> I don't know how to respond to that. I'm not good at taking compliments. I will admit that now. Um... Is Indiana Jones confirmed? What? Indy. Oh, Indy. Yes. Yes. Um... Indoor Petrichor the second is in fact Indiana Jones. Um, so catch them raiding tombs. Wait, no, is that Lara Croft? <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, just just a regular regular archaeologist. I'm so sorry, I didn't mean to you know um, give away your secret. Oh, thank you, Lucy. <laughs> um, right. Switch realm style, I know what I'm doing. I can click buttons. Um, actually I shouldn't be allowed to click buttons, it's always a mistake. Oh, I have clicked it, okay, okay. Indy, I'm gonna take that personally. <laughs> I'm gonna take that as a personal attack, thank you. Um, there is just like giggling coming from behind me. <laughs> Now it's cackling. <laughs> I can't tell who it is. <laughs> right, are we- are we- sh am I showing off your teapot? Okay, this is Keiko's teapot. Um, in all its glory, with all the chaos that Keiko did, which, let it be known, Keiko is chaotic in her own way, and she has done the chaos. You can see it, you can see it with what she's done in her teapot, so I think we need to take this as evidence that Keiko is, in fact, a chaotic entity, and she needs to stop denying it. <laughs> um, you should know that it only looks good because Child of Peace fixed it twice. I fixed it a little. No, you fixed it the first time. Yeah, I got this room the way it is. This room looks the way it does because of me. So, I will admit that. Um... Did you ch change any- oh, have we shown off the cat room? Well, this is the cat room, where of course the cats belong, and we've got cat trees right in front of the fish tank so that the cats can watch the fish play. Um, because that's what cats like to do, even though the some of the fish are actually as big as the cats, so I doubt they would be cat food. So yes, we've got lots of little, um, cat trees, cat beds, all around, and a sofa, of course, if you want to go sit down with the cats, because who doesn't love sitting down with a cat on your lap? Oh my god, it's like that song! I can't come into work today because I've got a cat on my lap. Keiko loves that song, to clarify. I do. You do! You, you, keep, now. you keep sending me it every time you find it. Hey, I can't come into work today, I've got a cat on my lap. I do? You keep sending it to me! When? On Instagram! How long ago? <laughs> okay, to be fair, you haven't done it recently. Maybe it was an old thing. Uh, did you change this room at all, or is this just how I- Oh no, you added this lovely moment here with some tea. Lovely. We love a good- well, I, I actually don't drink tea, but I can pretend. Um, we got, of course, we got Paimon here, and I think the rest of this was the rest of this what I did. No, I fixed it. You fixed. But you were yeah. A moderating me via WhatsApp. Oh yeah, I was. She was sending me screenshots on WhatsApp, and I was going, mm, no, I think that needs to go there. And then this, I think, was this. This was just me, right? Okay, then that's already been shown off, although if anyone hasn't seen it, this is the kitchen. Um, we have of course got the cooking pot in the command position so you can watch the door. Oh, hello, there's a raider! I don't know what to do with raiders. Um, hi, I am not Keiko. I am Child of Peace. I am just here... I don't know. I'm just here to, um, invade. I don't know. I've taken over the stream and Keiko's never getting it back. Hello. <laughs> Hello, welcome Raiders. Um, th this is actual Keiko. We have a bit of a chaos stream today because Child of Peace came to visit, Child of Peace being my moderator. 
and um, I, I let them uh, be in charge for a while because they're um, showing off the teapot because uh, apparently I commit interior design crime sometimes. You do. And Child of Peace fixed it. And so like they're saying now I did a good job, but that's because I just didn't break what they fixed the first time. <laughs> and my like second round additions weren't that bad. So hello, welcome, welcome. I will, <laughs> yeah, so <laughs> hello. <laughs> I might make show up again later, who knows? I'm just here in the background. Welcome. <laughs> Yes, welcome to the Raiders. Um, I, I don't... How do I... Okay. Um, oh. Everyone's pronouns in this room? Or everyone's pronouns in the chat? Also, I haven't read any of the messages. I can't... How do I get to that bit of the screen? I can't scroll up. You have to press alt so that you're no longer playing. Oh, okay. Thank you. Oh, I, your mouse is terrible with scrolling. Or at least for me, I can't do it. Um, okay, right. Um... Oh, again, thank you, Lissy. Um... I still think Keiko is favourite, but I'm biased, so there's that. Um... We need child appreciation redeem. What would that look like? I, I just want to know, what, what vibes do you have in mind for a child appreciation? I'm not gonna make you draw it, I'm just asking for vibes. Um, yeah, Indo Petrico has never laughed in their life. Um, <laughs> <laughs> never mind, they have laughed for the first time ever. Guys, this is a momentous occasion. Um, we have the first ever laugh from Indy. Um, yeah, this is my channel now, correct. Um, that is true, that is true. Keiko Appreciation is appreciating me because I made that beautiful, beautiful photo of Keiko and Mr. Blobby's wedding. It was a brilliant day, you know, I got to be like, sort of, friend of honour. So, you know, there was that. It was great. <laughs> and photographer as well, clearly, because that's how we have the photo. Um, no, please, please don't vote for me to replace Keiko. I can't do this. This is already stressful enough and I've only done it for, like, 10 minutes? Um, please don't, please don't raise your hands. Please don't. I beg, I beg of you. Um, yeah, I would also miss Keiko if she was replaced. I am quite happy to sit behind my laptop and mod most of the time. Um, <gasps> Mr. Blobby loves me. I love Mr. Blobby too. Mr. Blobby is beloved by all. We must worship Mr. Blobby because he is great. For anyone who doesn't know, um, we to annoy Keiko because um, she doesn't like that we worship Mr. Blobby. We started worshiping Mr. Blobby. Um, it's just, you know, Mr. Blobby is a chaos entity and you've got to support your chaos entities when you are yourself a chaos entity. And uh, it just, you know, added bonus that Keiko goes, no, why are you guys like this? Which is my favourite thing to hear from her. Um, right. Keiko is being possessed. Yes, she is. I am great at possessions. I have been working hard, so I'm really grateful that you are appreciating my brilliance in possession. Um, right. Uh, was there any confirmation on pronouns? Because if not, I will just say my pronouns are they, them. Does anyone else want to, want to share yours? Okay, um, and Indy's pronouns are they, them as well. And of course everyone knows Keiko's pronouns are she, her. Um, stacked all of the items on top of each other. Oh. Oh, is this, um... Oh yeah, teapot. H how do you stack the items on top of each other? I couldn't... F I, I would love to stack some things on top of each other. Not all of the items, but some of them. So if you can tell me how to do that, I would absolutely love it. Um... <laughs> uh... Yeah, I mean... I... 
The only reason I know what I'm doing is because I've seen somebody on YouTube who does lots of videos on Feng Shui and, you know, uh, and I play a lot of Sims, so that's why my teapot look. That's why my teapot, I've, I've stolen your teapot. <laughs> that's why Keiko's teapot looks the way it does, and it's purely based on my own, um, you know, my own playing of Sims and everything else. Uh, thank you, Lissy. It's been 20 minutes. Oh God. Okay. Um, why are you letting me talk to people? This is was this was a mistake. Oh, uh, there was a but buttons followed and Keiko says thank you. Um, <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm. Uh, that was that was. I know that sound sound sa sa sounded disingenuous, but I promise you, it was genuine. Um, that is a genuine thank you. Um, we appreciate all the follows. Um, oh, is it this? Is this where I'm supposed to check for followers? Okay, I did not even know that was there. Um, so thank you very much, Buttons, for following. You will enjoy the chaos. Even on normal streams, there's so much chaos and it's so worth it, I promise you. And it's I'm not just saying that because I'm biased, though I am saying it a little bit because I'm biased. Um, <laughs> uh, chaos entities support chaos entities. Yeah, absolutely. That is what we are here for. Um, oh, Arve's here. Hello, Arve. Wait, it is Arve, isn't it? Yeah, yeah cool. Um, yes, Child is definitely possessing Keiko. Um, mm, yeah, um, I, I am definitely. I am a ghost, and I am possessing Keiko right now. Keiko has. <laughs> yes. Um, yeah, Keiko is here. She's behind me right now. Um, are you on my computer or not? Are you not modding? I am on two computers. Oh, okay. So you are modding as well. Okay, yeah. Keiko is having a go at modding because um, she doesn't know what she... Oh god, I clicked a button. Um, she doesn't know what she's doing with modding where I don't know what I'm doing with streaming. So um, this is a fun experience for both of us. Uh, right. So, this is the upstairs. This is where Keiko's chaos comes in. So I suggested this lovely little tea table moment. Uh, Keiko put this in, of course. Um, she also put one in the other corner because symmetry, I, I guess. I, I think she was going for some semblance of um, order in the chaos because you can't have chaos without order. They belong together. Um, I am quoting a comic book there, I'm so sorry. I'm just gonna go around clicking buttons because you know what, that's what we're here for. But yes, Keiko put in this armory, which actually I thought was a really good idea, having a little armory. I think it works and I think she did a good job with this, even though she thinks that it's somehow not as good as what she actually did. And she was trying to talk me out of saying that she did a good job. Um, this is a writing desk that I think you put in. You put it in? Yeah. Yeah. I put things under the stairs as well. Oh. Oh yeah, you put things in under the stairs. I'll go back and look at that in a second. Um, yeah, I think you put all this in as well. Yeah. Put the funky little mushroom lamp thing. I don't think it's a lamp. And she put in this book nook, which I think is very cool. I added this bit in and moved the books to there. Probably was better the way she did it, but... I think the problem actually is, I figured out what the problem that I was having with it is. It's the, the sofa is facing the wrong way. I don't like the way that the sofa should be facing the book nook. That's what the problem was. And I didn't realize that until right now. Oh, I forgot I accidentally left that there. That's only on the floor because I put it there and I forgot to put it away. Um, then this is Jean's office, which you rearranged, didn't you? No, when you placed it, you rearranged the furniture because wasn't it like the set furniture? Oh, yeah. yeah. So Keiko rearranged it so it looks as good as it does. We love this vibe. Um, and we have, of course, got that is Jean, isn't it? I'm not mi 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 mixing things up in my head. Yeah, that's Jean. Cool. Um, right, and the other room. Oh god, it's so far to get around to the other room. Uh. The other room here, I think, 
Did you change anything? <laughs> Dude, if you don't know, how am I supposed to know? <laughs> oh, that's fair. Um... Oh yeah, Keiko said that she doesn't remember the last time she did a tour. If anyone else does, please tell us in the comments because we're messes. Um, yeah, this is what Keiko added. She added like, oh, what is this? What's this? You got... Hmm? The cards. The cards? Oh, those are cards. Cool. Okay, so yes, Keiko put a little card game mo moment down here. I don't know why I keep saying moment. That is, that I think I got from a YouTuber, so I'm so sorry. Um, and then yeah, did you put these in as well? Yeah, Keiko added the bookshelves. So I'm gonna check the com the comments and then I'm gonna pass back over the to chat. Keiko. The chat, the chat, same difference. <laughs> I know what I'm doing, I promise. I'm lying. Shh. Um. Oh, thank you, Lissy. Um. Yes, we did just swap. I, I. Unfortunately, no. I, I'm definitely very capable of possessing people. That is, I went to a school for ghosts, and I definitely learned how to possess people. People. Um. Yes, Indiana Jones is chilling in the back. What? <laughs> you didn't- what? Your channel She's point. not claiming points. Not getting oh, seeds. Excuse you, you- you're not getting me seeds? You're on my computer! Dude! Keiko's never actually had to be on the other side of this, and she is costing me precious seeds that I could be using to torture her with. So disappointed in you right now. <laughs> um, <laughs> uh, yes, Indiana Jones is sitting in the room with us. Uh, no, I just, I've nicknamed Indoor Petrichor the second Indy just because it's easier than saying Indoor Petrichor the second every time. Keiko may, may be willing to do that, but like I said, I have a bit of a stutter sometimes and it's just easier to say a shorter name. Um, no, no, those work absences are just because I get lots of colds. <laughs> Nothing suspicious, no adventures. Mmm, I believe you. Definitely believe that. Uh, Jeeb. Yes, Jeeb. Jeeb is there. We love Jeeb. Um, oh, it was a couple of months ago was the last time you did a tour. So that was actually fairly recently then. Um, <laughs> I do know what I'm doing, definitely. I am also lying, yes. Um, you are welcome to be our chill leader, but I imagine it would get quite boring relatively quickly because, um, I, I don't know. Elysiana is a lovely name, though. I really do like that name. But yes, we do tend to refer to you as Lissy anyway. Right, do you want to take back over now? <laughs> Please. Huh? One. One. Hello, I am back. <laughs> you just gotta ignore the little bit of, um, <clears throat> the little bit of... Just in the, I, Keiko looked like she was in real distress there for a second <laughs> when, uh, we moved. Um, <laughs> it got a bit funny. Anyway, anyway, let me see. Why aren't you gonna fight Charles? Yes, but that's... that's late. I mean, I think I'm gonna let them loose in Fontaine as well. I figured I'd show you the outside. I don't remember if I've done that recently, because... <laughs> It was a while ago we did a, a teapot stream and I forget what I've changed in the meantime because how am I supposed to remember what I changed in the meantime? My teapot's just crazy! <laughs> um, let's see... Oh, hello buttons! Welcome from me, properly! <laughs> well, I guess I did welcome you earlier. Um, and hello Ave. I think I saw you showed up in the middle somewhere. Welcome, welcome. Um, yeah, so I think the only thing I changed on this island is I added some plants! <laughs> For no reason, I just had a tiny bit of space left, and I thought, why not? Um, but this is still my favourite section of this island, and you know why? 
because Yao Yao's here. We love Yao Yao. <laughs> and obviously I had to put it next to the cranes and next to this little fish fish thing. Um, and then there's a little, little chill little teapot section here, which we like, we like. Um, <laughs> yeah, Child of Peace didn't touch the outside of my islands. They only did the house. So the rest of it is all my own. Well, I think they did a little bit. They were just judging me. <laughs> it was, um, yeah. It was a bit of a mess. No, I think they moved, they removed the table here. I don't know why they removed the table, but they didn't like it. I used to have four of these tables and one of them is gone now. Um, but yeah, this is my second island. We've got, I don't know, it's got like a Ligua village vibe to it. So we've got a little pool. This is because I wanted a set, because look, you can invite people. I can bring Yao Yao over here. <laughs> so I wanted that set to be here as a set. Which means I had to get like incredibly creative. Like, do you wanna, I will demonstrate what I mean. Do you see this set? Do you see how I had to position everything? Like this house is part of the set. It's barely hanging in there because I needed it to be as far like to the side with while still being in the set. And I had to get these ones all the way over here so that it didn't feel so much like a little circle. It felt more like part of the island as a whole. It took a long time. So that's why these tables are so very on the edge. They're as far out as I could get them without, you know, still being in the set. But you know, I'm quite proud of that. I did, I did a good job. <laughs> um, and then yeah, so we've got this section. And then up here, oh, we've got Sinyan here, because Sinyan is obviously watching Yunjin on the stage. And if you look up on the stage, recently, I got a little gong. You can hear it. I don't know if you can hear it, but I can hear it. And I also put up some little you know, some live music so Yunjin can uh, perform to her very best. So we, we've got this section here. I was going to put some fireworks behind, but it took up too much load space or whatever. It didn't like it. It didn't like it. <laughs> so anyway, this is my little Liyue little marketplace as well. I, th I like this island. And then we've got this island. This is my favorite island because it's the good one. Um, see, the thing is, I'm not that terrible in- it was my- I put too many items in a place and that's why it always looks horrible because I have no sense of- you really don't need that many bookshelves. <laughs> so that's why my houses do terrible. But this is the Nahida Island. It's the best island I've ever done. We've got this little section with all the crystal flies. And then down here we've got some birds. And we've got Nahida next to a little swing. Because- and they're like the glowy- the glowy fountain uh, flowers. And I think- where's the rustling bush? This bush, you can like rustle it. <laughs> I love it so much. I think I discovered this by accident and it's beautiful. Beautiful. Um, so this looks better from, I don't know, because it, it kind of, you need to be far enough away to appreciate it, but you can't be too far away, otherwise you can't see the details. But yeah, so we've got this little section here with the glowing and then we've got the pink and purple section, which is just beautiful. I, I tried landscaping basically with some like rock formations and I thought I thought you did a good job and then transitions to like red and this section is more like green and then over here we have a little there's just a random bonsai tree I don't know why this is here I put it there aesthetics. on a whim Child of Peace says aesthetics <laughs> and we've got a little hot tub well not hot tub like a hot spring <laughs> like a you know oh you can sit yeah yow yow I don't think you should uh now your clothes are gonna get all wet. Yow yow, get, get out of the water. Um, but uh, yeah, I thought it, I don't know, it was quite peaceful. And I've got these three little shroom balloons. Uh, not shroom, slime balloons. There's one over there, there's one over there, and there's one over there in the distance. This is my favorite island. I'm very proud of this one. It's just, it's just, I like the colored trees really, and this little glowing section over here. Best thing. And then in this corner, you'll notice we have clay. <laughs> Um, and then, yeah, and then we've got this section, which is, there's a big tree. No particular reason, it's just a big tree. Um, and then we've got, basically, I, I liked the idea of having this little park, which is like, it's the, you know, the this park where you can bring Jean. <laughs> it's one of her sets. So I, I tried to put it here, and I tried to make it look as not, like, as uh, integrated as I could. I put that one there, and then I put this little section here for Nahida, which is, I think, a Nahida section. Just got it close enough for the invite. Oh, there we go. Oh, come back. Yeah, it's Nahida's section. <laughs> like one of her little 
things. And I don't know, it just felt like this is a little park island, I guess. And then I thought it would be nice to put Klee here. So I gave her a little Dodoko umbrella, a little little chair, and then Klee's here. And then we've also got some butterflies because this fits in perfectly with the vibes. Um, and then we've got... Oh, and then I just, <laughs> I don't know what, I got these flags from I think the Interdarshan Championship and I thought, why not? And similarly, these things from the TCG game, like the little tournament, I, I just put them here for no particular reason. And I think there's also some boxes from the, the really recent Lorian Mirage thing. Again, no particular reason. I just thought, why not? This is a bit of a chaos island. And uh, they kind of fit the vibe. So yeah, that's my teapot. Let me see, let me see. What have I missed? Uh, you remember what my old one was? Ooh, cool, cool. I don't. <laughs> uh, you like it when people remember how to pronounce your name? Oh, that's always a good thing. We love it when people pronounce names correctly. Two yao yaos, yes. Always two yao yaos, best thing. Um, welcome back, Keiko. How was your journey to the other side? It was really weird being on the receiving end. And actually, like, because <laughs> I guess technically I'm a moderator of my own stream, but I've never seen it in like mod view where you can like do things to the messages. It was really weird. And then I had to bring my laptop down so I could press the buttons. So I, I was sitting there with two screens, one screen setting up the polls. And you one screen. not getting my seeds for me. Yeah, I, I forgot to collect the bonus seeds. You know, I think there's bonus seeds you get if you're paying attention. I, I wasn't paying attention, so I, I didn't get them for Child of Peace. My bad. <laughs> but um, so I was using my screen to check out like stats and stuff and then Child of Peace's screen to actually read the chat because <laughs> my laptop setup it means I can't actually read anything but uh, I fixed it anyway oh, it's so nice thank you <laughs> I worked hard on this teapot I think I haven't changed much most like I do little additions here and there like this has been the same for quite a while except obviously I added this section and I added Klee once I got her like immediately as soon as I got Klee I was like I gotta put her in the teapot so I had to put her in the teapot <laughs> had to remove- I think there was a little bird here. I had to get rid of the bird because it was taking up too much load space or whatever you call it. And we needed- we needed clear. <laughs> um... Okay, okay, okay. What else have I missed? Do I want me to close the curtains? I don't know. Do, if you think the curtains should be closed, close the curtains. Oh, no. Then close the curtains. Okay, the curtains are still open, you see. And apparently, they shouldn't be. <laughs> because you get flies in because windows open. There aren't usually flies in it. Usually I leave the curtains open. <laughs> okay, fine. Anyway, uh, Indy, you gonna play Genshin? I have no idea. That's up to Indy, really. The, the offer is open, <laughs> but I don't know if they're gonna want to. Um, you think we'd all cry if we saw your teapot? It's so bad. I mean... I don't know. Well, maybe. You can, I don't know, take some inspiration from Child of Pieces Feng Shui, and you can have a great teapot. <laughs> Uh, what level are your fountains? Oh, Fontaine. See, I haven't been back to- I assume this is the Fontaine fountain. Haven't been back, so zero. I don't even know what that means. So zero. <laughs> um, okay, okay. Let me see- oh, Rainbow Gecko! Say hello, Rainbow Gecko! Good to see you, good to see you. We're uh, in the teapot. We're about finished with the teapot, actually. I think we're gonna- oh, I didn't do my wishes today! I should do that. Well, actually, I think I'll let Child of Peace do that. Maybe they'll have better luck than me. <laughs> That's a mistake. Maybe Indle Petrical wants to have a go then, because Child of Peace, uh, I don't know if you could hear that, but they made a sound of a disagreement with my previous statement. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, anyway, um, let me see. I have to get the extra seeds. I... I'm sorry. <laughs> Wait, Indle Petrical, you have deemed a hydrate. Oh, you needed water. Oh my gosh. Oh, we just switched these back. Where's... <laughs> I, we moved our water bottles slash glasses. <laughs> we just, just switched them back. Let me have some water. I can't believe you didn't just drink... I drank some water while sitting on the floor. <laughs> but you made all of us hydrate with you. Okay, great. It's a group exercise, Keiko. I don't know if you could hear that, but Jonathan <laughs> said it was a group exercise, which is true. I, I guess it is. Um... <laughs> <sighs> you had a random nap for 22 minutes? Fair. I do that all the time. It's good, it's good. Well, maybe not so good for your overall sleep schedule, but in general, I like a good nap. Anyway, uh, <laughs> you felt lonely drinking all that water by yourself. Okay, f fair enough, fair enough. Anyway, what are we gonna do today? 
I forgot, I'll be honest, I had a plan. The plan is gone. <laughs> I lost it. But that's fine. It'll be fine. We're gonna go over here. Oh, what is this thing? A hotel? There's a hotel? Okay, okay, we're teleporting here because I think, I think Fontaine is working now. We can test it out. <laughs> you can hear child? Okay, cool, cool. Good to see. Good to see. Good, well, not see, good to know. Okay, because I can sort of see the thing, but I don't know how clearly you can hear it, but okay. All good, all good. Have we got the new character? If you mean Linny, no. If you mean Lynette, who you got for free, yes. <laughs> um... Anyway, what are we gonna do? Oh, Fontaine. So Fontaine, wishes. last wishes. Yes, wishes. <laughs> I'm doing this. Is he gonna do them? I, I think so. Just a click. <laughs> okay. So once this loads, it's taking a moment because we were in the teapot too long. Genshin unloaded the map, and also we're going to Fontaine. Fontaine is never loaded because I haven't been there really. Um, let me see. Does child like child? I don't know. Child, do you like child? We are sworn enemies because of our similar names, and you cannot be friends with the names too. To be fair, they do have a point there. <laughs> it is very confusing when people have the same name. It's like the Josh fight! The, jo <gasps> the Josh fight! That's the thing with like, where all the Josh is. It's like a... the Josh one! Yeah, the Josh fight! Classic, classic moment in like... Inter is it internet history? I bet it's I internet so. history. They created a group on like, Facebook, I'm pretty <laughs> oh, sure. Oh, nice. I knew I was so nice, you've already explored two thirds of it. Ooh, exciting. See, I tried to do it last stream and then it didn't really work. <laughs> so I gave up and went to the chasm. So I started exploring the chasm, if anyone missed that. That was quite exciting. Um, but yeah. <laughs> okay, okay, let me see. What was I gonna do? Oh, wishes, right. Oh wait, no, I was gonna explain something and then do the wishes. I did this in the wrong order. I need to quit out of this page. Okay, perfect. So basically, this has unlocked now. So, if you see this, it has a bunch of little quests. And they're simple quests, like gather six flowers, gather five... Like, look at these pretty flowers! Look at them! Oh. And it's just a simple quest. Gather gather some items, and then... Oh, there's quite a lot of these. And it looks like you have to fight a crab and fight a little robot. And then, um... Some more... Just more finding things. And more fight fighting things? I think these are, you know... Oh, and then that's like a boss fight, and there's also a boss fight. So I figured I would see. <laughs> well, someone is going to be doing these quests today, or at least attempting to start them. I figured I'd see if either of the other two wanted to have a go, because, you know, I, th I figured gathering flowers seems like a fairly simple thing to introduce you to the game. <laughs> that we will somehow manage to mess up. Yes, but <laughs> it's very simple, and, you know, it's because it starts slow, gathering flowers, and then, then it builds up a little bit, fighting. These seem like fairly simple enemies, and I'm aware that now I'm world level 8, they're going to be kind of high leveled, but also, also, Yao Yao is very high leveled, so you're already at an advantage here. <laughs> so I figured, oh, I should probably switch my party back to the uh, the better fighting party, but you know, I figured we, we could have a, give it a go, and you know, they could have, they could have a go. And yeah. This is mostly going to be me sitting there. It's, there's something planned. I don't know what they're doing. But there is a plan at some point. Something's going to happen. Don't know what it is. I just know that they've been, like, giggling. <laughs> the plan's already happening, man. The plan's already happening. What does that mean? I, I don't know. It is like I don't even know. <sighs> anyway. <laughs> so, yeah. I figured I'd see. Um, while I'm responding to the chat, you guys think about whether or not you want to have a go. <laughs> Um, let me see, let me see. Ah, uh, no one has your name. You have- oh, that is true, Missy. You do have your name. <laughs> uh, ooh, interesting. Interesting. Uh, nice easy event for you to explore the map. Yes! Yes, that's- that was exactly my thinking. <laughs> uh, you like the Genshin Gods, you don't have a cold this time. Oh yeah, I remember last time you were just sort of coughing in the background and people would forget you were there. <laughs> You'd just cough. Um, and fall off it? Almost definitely. But we love it. Now uh, you can fight dance, robot, times two, two bosses, and child. Oh yes, that'll be exciting for boss fights today. The crab dance, the dance, robot, times two, the crab, and child. Okay, I kind of want to fight the robots and the crab though. At least one of the robots. So, gonna have to... But I'll let child fight child. <laughs> um, 
Ooh, I think though, with the new thing, the diving, you don't drown. So that that's exciting. I, <laughs> I haven't tried it yet, but as a concept, I'm kind of jealous that these guys aren't gonna drown. Immediately, I always do that. Every time I enter a body of water, somebody perishes and it's always really sad. It happens. It's such a formal way of saying it, I love it. <laughs> um, don't fight child. Uh, you fight both the robots. I'm so sorry. Um, yes, but I, I think there's like two versions, right? So I want to try at least, because I assume you fight both of them, but you only get rewards from one of them. I, I don't actually know. That's what I sort of got the impression of. In which case, I want to do at least one of those fights. Someone else can do the other one <laughs> if they want to. Um, a child of peace, you've been so oh. <laughs> okay, anyway, so d do either of you want to have a go at uh, gathering flowers? Oh yeah, I'll gather flowers. Indle Petrical, do you want to have a go? Indle Petrical's gonna do the wish, <laughs> child of peace is gonna do the, the flowers, so. I hydrated without you, I'm so sorry. <laughs> you hydrated? Oh gosh. Anyway, um, so, we're gonna have another quick pause. Uh, we, we don't fight child, we have cake and biscuits with child. But the thing is, I think Ch Child enjoys a good fight, right? And therefore, we can have cake and biscuits after. Like, he he'd take that as a nice little warm-up, you know? Like, he wouldn't think this was antagonistic, he would just enjoy it. Oh, two more hydrates. <laughs> drink some more water. That's three. Oh, three, never mind. Oh, four. Oh, oh gosh. <laughs> Pip, you know, if we run out of water, whoever's not sitting in the chair has to go get more. <laughs> <laughs> oh, another one. Oh, great. Oh, <laughs> oh, no, two. Oh, God. I shouldn't have said I that. Keep coming. <laughs> oh, God. oh, no, there's too many of you. Okay, I think I got up to the two lists. I'm going to wait until you stop. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. I regret oh, saying God. that now. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> what have I done? <laughs> One, two. Okay, we just have, we just have to wait. I can't keep track. I can't keep track. Why are there so many of you involved in this? And why do you have so many seeds? There's three people. Just using up all of their seeds that they've been saving up for so long. Oh gosh, I I don't even want to count these. You've scrolled past the screen like twice. No, Rainbow Gecko! Rainbow Gecko, don't do it! You can use better things! You don't forget, Child of Peace is in the room with me, which means if you redeem a silly voice roulette, you get to hear both versions of the silly voice, which also means you get to see, hear how badly I failed at mimicking Child of Peace. I have a really good idea for that! <sighs> Gosh. Oh god! Guys. You do realise there is a limit, right? <laughs> At some point, we're just gonna stop drinking water. The limit should have been like 10 minutes ago. <laughs> Please change that. I can't. I have to just turn it off manually. You can't put a hard stop on it. <laughs> oh gosh. <laughs> I don't even want to know how many you redeemed. <laughs> Is this soft hyphens like threat for 100 hydrates for like ages ago? <laughs> oh gosh. Oh, <sighs> yeah, well, I got up to the two lissies. <laughs> you guys are gonna make me cry. <laughs> oh dear. Oh god, you're still going. 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 41, 42, Echo to 160. Oh gosh. Okay, 69, 69, 70, 80, 80, 80, 80, 80, 80, 80, 80, 80, 80, 80, 80, 80, 80, 80, 80, 80, 80, 80, 80, 80, 80, 80, 80, 80, 80, 80, 80, 80, 80, 80, 80, 80, 80, 80, 80, 80,
do it all in one go because someone's gonna- I only have one cup of water left. I- someone's gonna have to go and get more water. <laughs> we- we start- okay, wait, how many was there? Let's see, it was 91, right? 91. God, okay, no one do that again. I will turn it off. Okay, let me see. Um... Uh, well, I guess it's a good thing it's a hot day today. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, okay, um... <laughs> taking small sips. <laughs> I might mute that actually, because you're just gonna hear me drinking water. <laughs> and you know what? I worry we're just gonna I'm just gonna drink it in silence. <laughs> Give us a moment. And at 20. 40. <laughs> this is glass three. For context. <laughs> Trying to be just maybe laugh. And I almost died from like choking on water, but we're good now. <laughs> I'm at like 46. I just had a moment. Um, <laughs> this is, this is, why did you guys do this? Okay, everyone else finished, but I'm only on 75. We're, I'm getting there, slowly but surely. But uh, I'll also explain why we all burst until after earlier. It was quite funny, but um, it was quite funny. Okay, <laughs> um, let me see, let me see. Uh, breaking news. <laughs> Three people drink all of Britain's water supply. <laughs> I can't believe all of you like drained your seed balances. Except Rainbow Gecko, but that scares me more, honestly. <laughs> Thank you for the latest news, and now we go to Gecko who's drinking this much water. <laughs> yeah, pretty much, pretty much. Um, so yeah, Chalamis made us all laugh, and I saw the like, <laughs> There was a moment there, I'm glad I was muted. Um, <laughs> and yeah, I guess we did tempt fate. <laughs> I made bad choices. How do I feel? A little bit terrible. There was a lot of water to drink in one go. But it's fine. Um, <laughs> how many glasses have we drunk between us? Well, I have finished two and three quarters of a glass. <laughs> um, I, I think they all have bottles. I don't know. I managed to do all of them, but still only drink half of my bottle. How the- I guess Child of Peace is taking smaller sips than me. Yeah, and I, because the way my bottle works, it enables me to take really small sips. They have like a LucasAid bottle type bottle. Yeah. Whereas I have a glass and Indoor Festival has like a metal water bottle. Um, I had them refill it. Basically, the reason we were laughing is as we were talking about having to get more water, so, um, my mother showed up at the door with a jug. She just appeared. And that's why we were all laughing, because we didn't actually have to go and get more water. <laughs> because it just arrived for us perfectly in time. So I had to re- I only bring two glasses with me, because I anticipate you guys redeeming enough hydrates for me to need to drink two glasses of water, not three. <laughs> so a jug was procured, and it, it was sort of unprompted as well. It just appeared. I guess my mother could hear us <laughs> through the open window or something and knew we needed more water and so she brought up like a whole jug and just set it down <laughs> it was quite funny um okay okay thanks for watching everyone if you've enjoyed the video make sure to like and subscribe if you'd like to see me play live then check out my twitch channel you can find me on wednesdays and sundays at 8 p.m gmt thanks again and have a great day